What the fuck do you mean it isn't? That's right, guys. I'm back. Again. It takes a while to make these videos. That's not true. I'm just slacking off. Let's get right into the main topic. So I don't listen to the most normal of music types, not like the most cultural standard. In fact, I'm what some would call weird. Believe it or not, yes, I, Quest Taker, am weird. And with this uh, comes a love of different music genres. Uh, I'm not as diverse in my music genres as most people, but this all leading up to the point I'm trying to make is when I tell people that I listen to a certain music genre, they'll say, that's not real music. Now, what real music is, is that what I've come to understand about it at least, is that it's something that people say when you don't listen to the music genre that they listen to. Basically judging you for your music opinion. Which is the stupidest shit, because <laughs> music is so nuanced and so personal. It's just a personal choice, like I like what I like because of how I grew up or something else. It could also be like, you're forced to listen to it every day because your dad keeps putting it on, on the radio and you want to kill yourself. That's also a possibility. But what I'm trying to say here is that there is no such thing as real music. People who say that's not real music just have a small dick or are insecure about other things in their life. What is real music? And this was the question I asked to one of my friends. And he replied with an explanation that real music is the genres of music that I listen to most. That that person listens to most, so when you introduce new genres of music, that's not real music to them. Let's say I listen to heavy metal. Death, how about death metal? Because that's, you know, I love death, you know me. Uh, but my friend listens to hip-hop. So when he puts on music in the car, some people respond with, Ew, what is this? That's not real music. Or, I'm gonna call the police, why are you touching me there? That kind of response just really tells you all you need to know about that person. Their real music is complete bullshit. In fact, it is one of the most stupid shit I've ever heard of, as I've explained. So if you ever, like, you know, say that's not real music to one of your friends, I just want your friend to look you dead in the eyes and say, why are you sleeping with my girlfriend? And then those kind of interactions can happen and you can become better friends because of that or you'll just break off entirely. The point I'm trying to make here is that there's no such thing as real music. It doesn't exist. In fact, it's just something that we fabricated to make everything seem in the norm. Uh, I sound like a conspiracy theorist at this point. Remember, Earth is not flat, nor is it round. In fact, it is just a donut floating through space. But either way, my friend thought the same thing I did about this. It's stupid, it shouldn't exist, and it's just people judging other people and their opinions because they can. I, now, I just didn't make this video to talk about real music, of course. I, um, I have several things planned for this video, including a long list of nothing, because I don't plan my videos, and they just happen to come to my mind when I am completely sleep-deprived at 2 a.m. Speaking of, I haven't slept in 24 hours. It's great. I love it. No, I don't. But the first experience I had somebody talking about real music was my brother in a car. He was listening to rap, so naturally they were saying the M-word at least 15 times a song. I think that's a minimum requirement to just even be considered rap at this point. Whenever I said that I didn't like the music choice, in fact, I like this, and I put it on, he said, that's not real music. And that's the first I ever heard of it. This real music enticed me. And I asked him, what the fuck does that even mean? Are you high right now? And besides him responding yes, he went on to explain that if it's not normal to listen to, it's not real music. Now, that's the stupidest shit I've ever heard of in my entire life. Smooth-brained individual. That got me thinking. Do actual people think like this? Of course they don't. There's no walking way that somebody unironically thinks that there is something called real music. Now, if I was listening to Jimmy Neutron grind out the electric triangle, that'd be completely one thing. But it's a, it's a different genre of music that they don't listen to, but they say it's not real. It just all goes down to people having different opinions, and it's just such a thing, and then people try to discredit their opinions by saying they're wrong, which I do a lot, actually. I like saying people's opinions are wrong, because some people's opinions are wrong. I mean, that's just a fact. But back on topic, what real music really boils down to is that if you're, you're insecure about your music tastes, or you have a small dick, or your crush dumped you, or you make VR games for a living, there's really nothing else that people can think of to do. Their IQ is that of room temperature. If you ever hear somebody utter the words real music, they're real stupid. Or they think that art is actually worth $32 million when it's just three splatters on a canvas. It's not worth $32 million. I I'm thinking about selling an NFT because I can make so much money off NFTs. I don't even know what I own. This, I'll sell this as an NFT. This picture right here. And boom, $50 million. Where am I? Oh yeah, I'm on a wall. It's a little glitchy right now, but uh, I can walk on walls. So with that, I just wanted to talk about that. I felt like it. It thought it'd be a good subject. But, I mean, there's really nothing else to talk about in this video. So, like it if you like it, dislike it if you disliked it, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, guys. Time to go kill some people. We are the music makers, and we are the dreamers of dreams.